Hey everybody, Ono I know you Thomas and this is a video on how to make Tally Lynn. Uh, yeah, Tally Lynn. Scarlet's twin, I guess. Yeah. You get the idea. Anyway, so um, so it's it, it was actually kinda of hard to make, especially the little window holes right there. Those were separately applied because I accidentally painted over the original ones. Well, I didn't accidentally, I kinda of meant to on purpose, but Anyway, I'll give you a quick 360 spin on him. So, yeah, this is what, this is by far my best homemade engine yet. Um, it, I just kind of took I took it apart. Sorry, I went off with the camera there. I took it all apart and. And what you have to do, I left one screw out because it's kind of stripped. I took out all these screws, took out the screw that was in there, and then just pulled them apart into three pieces. The part you take off to change the battery, this part, and then the wheels and the motor. And so, then I painted it all black, and some parts I kind of had to do a sharpie because I ran out of black paint. <laughs> and, um, then... And this part was with a silver sharpie. This was with some red paint. This was with the buffer beam was with red paint, and the back one was with red paint. Sorry. Um. All these little stripes with black parts on them. Those. This is just paper I like colored to look like it. With a gold pencil, black sharpie, and red sharpie. Um. I got a picture of his nameplate off the internet that I used for there. This part, I couldn't find a picture of it on the internet, so I just kind of drew it. There's supposed to be a little oval thing there. I think it has the number one on it. I don't know if it does. If somebody on you uh, out there knows, could you please comment and tell me? Um, well, that was kind of dumb to say. Now, probably a bunch of people comment. I don't know. I guess it kind of depends, but anyways. Um... So, yeah, the back windows were separately applied paper. Front windows were the little part there is. So, basically, you just paint it over black. And then you just add all those things with paper. And you use some red and silver on certain parts. And so, here, and I'll stand them up next to Scar Louie. So here he is. Now, um, like I said with Jinty, he will be in like episode remakes and music video remakes and episodes just an engine going by. And um, he may be in some of my Trackmaster Thomas shorts. Who knows? And so, yeah, it's nice. Another thing I want to tell you, um, the where the stripe is on Scarloli, how it bumps up there, you have to cut that off, so then you can get these on there. Just wanted to tell you that. So, um, I'll run him now. He, he runs very, very nicely. Let me show you with him. On some truck. It's funny, I had this guy like downstairs waiting to make him like, well see I make my videos all up in like our attic which is supposed to be upstairs, just upstairs not an attic. And, um, I had this guy downstairs waiting to, for me to make him, like, for a whole year. I just now got to making him, so. So, yeah, he runs very nicely, I must say, after taking him apart. And, um, so, yeah, I plan on using him in some of my videos, and... I hope you get an idea on how to make your own Trackmaster Tally Lynn. And another thing I want to say, you could leave the face on there if you wanted to. I chose not to. But, anyways, so, 
that this has been how to make a track master tally nin and this is 0903 thomas saying goodbye